guys right now we're working on a 95 Toyota Celica and it, you know it's an old car and the part of the exhaust pipe that comes out of co the converter has rusted but there's still a lot of life left on that exhaust pipe so we're just going to do a quick patch and I'll show you once we get below what exactly we're going to do but I'll show you a couple parts that we bought we bought a two and one quarter adapter on this side that converts into a one and seven eighths and the one and seven eighths part will go into the converter this two and one quarter part will go over the actual uh, pipe and of course you want to get exhaust clamps and here's the two and one quarter that's going to go over this larger portion and then one and seven eighths that's going to go over the smaller portion. We'll get below and we'll show you what exactly we're doing. Down below you can see the portion of the exhaust pipe and the flange part that connects just kind of rusted through and goes in the converter. So as we again put this larger two and one quarter part on that pipe right there this one to seven eighths part will fit just perfectly into that converter and then we'll use those clamps okay for this specific exhaust pipe you've got little rubber hanging boots there you want to pop these little pins out you got one here you got a couple in the back that I needed to take off just to give me the opportunity to, to shift this whole exhaust pipe back I'm about at six inches so now Got my buddy Nick down here helping me. He's got the adapter over the exhaust pipe and he's placed the 1 and 7 eighths portion into the converter. So now we're going to clamp it down and realign everything. Okay, as you can see right there, the rubber hanger or the rubber boot is back on the hanger. And come up here real quick. Okay, as you can see, the two and one quarter clamp is on, and the one seven eighths is installed inside the converter. And Nick did that as we fed it in. Next part is tightening these bolts down, or these nuts, and evenly tightening them so you don't want to tighten this one all the way and leave this one loose you want to do about five turns on this one come over to here do five turns and the whole purpose of this is to kind of crimp it together and alleviate a little bit of that space which will decrease that loud exhaust sound so and uh, you can add more clamps as you know the exhaust pipe wears but uh, it was such a the rest of the pipe was in such good condition we didn't want to go out and get a new pipe so guys if this helps like the video subscribe to the channel I, I sure hope this helps thanks guys